Hello, it's Dr. Maureen Craig, clinical nurse specialist with nephrology and your yoga teacher, talking to you a little bit um, about whole food plant-based living with my good friend, Al Schmidt. So some of you may have seen Al on the video, Eat Your Vegetables. He's gonna advertise his own website here. Don't, don't worry about that. <laughs> okay, so I remember when I showed that um, Eat Your Vegetables talk, one of the people in the audience asked me, is Al still alive? <laughs> Whoa! Al is Just still alive. Barely. Still alive and annoying people, yes. <laughs> yes. So Al, um, I wanted to ask you a couple questions. You've given me your time. One is, I have a lot of patients that are facing dialysis. They have lost much of their kidney function. They are on the cusp of going on dialysis. Yeah. They have the motivation and yet they're struggling to do the plant-based diet. What would you tell them to kind of get over the hurdle of trying it and or sticking with it? What are the things that, what are the elements that All make right. it do, go? You may not be surprised till I've given this a lot of thought. All right, here is my recommendations. Make, ask yourself, do I want to live? Real straightforward. Yeah. And if the answer is no, I don't care what you do, you don't care what you do. If the answer is yes, and it's yes, but forget that. It has to be yes. And then every decision you make after that will fall in place. You've already made the decision to eat healthy. So you are presented with two meals or two foods. One is healthy, one isn't. Which one do you eat? Well, duh, you eat the one that's healthy. So you don't hope to go on the diet. You don't wish to go on the lifestyle. On the lifestyle. You don't try. You try. I told somebody once, you try, you die. And unfortunately, that I met that person on a cruise. They're not around anymore. You don't try, you do it. If anything that's in your life, if you look back over it, if you're like most of us, if you've made a decision, do it. Yep, okay, so and go beyond trying to doing. You don't try. Now, you, you might it. make a few mistakes well, when you're trying, every, when you're no, doing. No, I've never made a mistake. Of course you make so, mistakes. Tell me about this, because some of the foods, you might taste them the first time, they don't taste good, or they're not, expe not as tasty as some of your old foods, right. or maybe you don't even know how to cook that right. well. Right. Do you just keep blundering through? Or? Yes. yes. I mean, nobody, if there was a magic bullet or a magic pill, I could say, oh, look, go take this or do that. You're going to make mistakes. I read Dr. Greger's book about his grandmother that in three weeks was walking 10 miles. It took me four weeks. So I'm slow, you know, but you, you do what you can do as long as you make the decision. You don't make the decision and go home and eat pretzels with a lot of salt or eat, mm -hmm. you know, bad food. It, it's just, it's the most, you've already admitted this to yourself, it's the most important thing in your life. Yeah. And if, now, You're ahead. mentioning that you read Dr. Greger's book. I How did. important is it that you start reading and learning? It's essential. I mean, it's, it's, it's like the food that you eat, they're self-reinforcing. After a while, your taste buds will change and you will really enjoy the food. And if you start to learn about what you can eat and what you can eat and what you can do, that becomes self-reinforcing. Uh, and one of the things I've always said is if you go out, if you're in a group at a dinner party and they're carnivores, Everybody, oh, I got sciatica, oh, my elbows hurt, oh, this. If you're in a whole food plant-based group, they think of creative ways to eat tasty food. Mm -hmm. Basically, it's positive versus negative, which, by the way, is another thing. Always be positive. Mm -hmm. You know, yep. you, if you fail, you say, I'll do better tomorrow. You don't say, oh, I, I failed. Ah, yes, you keep building yourself up. You have you keep to. trying again, you have doing to. again. And the lifestyle will build you up. Mm -hmm. First time I could climb up uh, uh, two flights of stairs, I couldn't believe it. Mm -hmm. So happy. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, celebrate and, it. Mm -hmm. And at 87, 
I don't have any aches or pains. Yeah. Now, I don't want to trade that for a piece of chocolate cake. Okay, I got one more question Annie, for you. Sure. When you and I met, yes. we both felt like lone soldiers in the trench. I was. We were doing something no one around us was doing. Correct. How, how do you work with friends and family, and how important is it that you find a tribe? If that's another, they're all important. You need support. And one of the reasons that I'm, I do things like this is because I got no support. I met you and every, you learn from everybody. You taught me the concept of journey. And it's a journey and I, oh yeah, it's, you pick a little here and there, but you need people that support you. You don't need people that say, oh, you're, you're on a funny diet. I'm gonna order steak and eat in front of you. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. you, you need support in anything you do in life. And it's not hard to get it. Mm -hmm. I got an email from a woman in Montana, and I told her it's essential you surround yourself with whole food, plant-based people because they're like-minded, they have similar goals and values. And she says, my nearest neighbor is 60 miles away. And I said, get on the internet. And so she did, and she started a whole food plant-based group. And I don't know where it is. I mean, I mean, I, it's in the internet, so I don't know where all of her members are. But Essentially, you create your tribe. So whether it be yes, in person or online, yes. you create your well tribe. Well said. And yes. we're lucky here in Sacramento, we've got a great tribe. We have a lot of mm -hmm. people here. Yeah. Yes. Come and join us. Yes. Okay. Thank you so much for your time, Al. Thank you for and having me. And I hope me. that you give this plan a try. Whole food, plant-based living can change the way your health is and the way you feel. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye. <laughs>